Hi friends, <clears throat> today I am going to tell you something very important about the tetanus. First of all, when you got any injury or the first time you were giving the TT at that time, the TT1, it doesn't give you, give you the protection for this injury. It gives you protection for previous injuries and if the TT2 is given after the four weeks it will give you a protection for about three years that is the gap of one month should be between the two TTs that is tetanus toxoide if another tetanus toxoide is given after the six month after the T2 that means it will give you a protection for about five years and if one more TT is given after the TT3 but it is given after one year it will give you protection for about 10 years so this is how the TT gives you the protection now let me you are seeing this animal actually this calf is of the buffalo and uh, he is suffering from the tetanus and I tried my best to give the protection to help this animal and uh, the immunoglobulins that were given to this animal was given from my pocket and Ultimately, I was not able to save his life. So, since it is very difficult to see the cases of tetanus toxoid, uh, the tetanus cases in the humans, so I thought that better to show this case. You can see the twitching, the muscle is spasm is there in this animal and uh, if there is a human uh, you can see the fever sweating and uh, heart rate increased as well as sometimes the patient undergo the office to tonus condition that is the bending of the backward bending uh, the body takes the shape of about the bow so this is how the tetanus patient look like incubation period is from few days to the month and nearly on an average it's about 10 days the treatment include giving the immunoglobulins by intramuscular or, in, or IV route giving the diaspalm or the muscle relaxant and metronidazole as well as keeping the person away from the light as well as from uh, voice I mean to say the loud noise and sometime the tracheostomy may be required magnesium is also helpful in preventing the muscle spasms, and sometime the patient go for the ventilation it's a difficult case to treat but the success is seen thank you for giving your valuable time thank you so much